Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. Worship you, Lord. Take all the glory in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. May the Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, help me to like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. Become one of us. God bless you as you do that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. They are realizing how powerful, how dedicated, how trustworthy, how lovable you are. Yeah. Someone is realizing it. Someone is realizing it. Someone is realizing it. Now they are beginning to realize that this person, your consistency, your persistence, he has become a power. Yeah. Yeah. Because when they look at you, they felt as if you were not supposed to have strength at all. You were not supposed to have joy at all. You were not supposed to still be where you are. You were not supposed to push at all. You were not supposed to survive at all. But they are beginning to realize that you really have the power of God in you. The Bible says, do not be afraid, little children. Say, for you have overcome the world. They can see their boldness in you. The Bible says, greater is he that is in you than them that is in the world. Greater is he that is in you. I repeat, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. And the Bible says, we will look unto the hills. From whence cometh our help? Our help cometh from the Lord, who made the heaven and the earth. Now you are getting help from the Lord. You are becoming so strong. You are using the authority in the name of Jesus. They are beginning to realize that, oh, oh, you were not playing. You are not playing. Yes, we are not here to play with the devil. We are not here to play with the devil. Neither are we there. Are we here to beg the enemy to release the things that belong to us? He said he has given us the authority to tread upon serpent and scorpion. They shall by no means hurt us. Now they are beginning to realize that you cannot be hurt. You will keep tread, you will, you will keep stamping on that scorpion, on that serpent. You will keep destroying the head of serpents. Child of God, by no means, they will not be able to hurt you. The word of God is powerful. He said, I have given you the power, the authority to tread upon serpent, upon scorpions. Who are the scorpions? Those that want to bite your life. Those that want to see you fail. Those that are making a contention to destroy your life. The, the things that bite the glory of people. That destroy the destiny of people. These are the scorpions we are talking about. These are the serpents that we are talking about. They are beginning to realize that you cannot be destroyed. It is even you that have the power to destroy their power. Their powers does not have the power to destroy your power. You know when a lesser power meets with a greater power, the lesser power will bow. The Bible said Dagon fell down before the ark of the Lord. Dagon bowed down before the ark of the Lord. When a lesser power meets with a greater power, the lesser power will surrender. I want you to know that you have the true power of God in you. Begin, continue to manifest the power of the Lord that is at work in you. It is well with the child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelisera. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.